Oh man, what a beautiful day here in Austria. Incredible mountains and right behind me, boom, we got Emco Machine Tools and there's a Hyperturn 65 with Titans of CNC's name on it. And uh, it's in this facility. We're gonna go check it out right now. Boom, let's go. Every machine has a customer name on it. So we don't produce any machine on stock. So that's very important for us. Every machine is flexible. We can have tail stock, we can have counter spindle with Y axis, no Y axis, whatever the customer decides what he wants. Pretty good. This is where assembly starts on this particular line right here. And then the machine actually gets put on this foundation right here, which is on the near guides. Basically runs all the way down. So at each stage, it basically gets more complete, more complete, more complete. Now you got sheet metal getting on it. Boom, boom. You can see it's just getting more complete, more complete. Gotta love it. Seamless control right there. Step by step, the machines are completed until we reach a step where we put life into the machine. We have the CNC controller on it. We set up the CNC controller. We can dry cycle the machine and at the end we make the runoff. Up here we have all the Hyperturn 65s. It's kind of like the finishing department where they're actually adding add-ons to the machines. One of the things about these machines that you'll notice is look at the foundation. The foundation is absolutely amazing. Like rigid, low to the ground. The quality is incredible. Anybody out there that has an Enco machine, ask them about that machine and they're gonna tell you that it is amazing. These machines last decades. Oh man, shout out to Shank right there. So you wanna see something that's awesome? So this machine right here, this is for Titans of CNC, right? That's the machine. That's the machine that's the right machine there. machine on the market. Oh man, <laughs> so good. So this bad boy is coming to Texas. So what do you have, like a couple more weeks? A couple more weeks, yes. Couple a couple more weeks. more weeks, then it should be finished. Tyson, this is the machine right here. Oh man, isn't this insane? This machine is here in Austria and it's gonna be in Texas in about three to four weeks. And uh, I get to come over here and hang out with my wife. What's up, Gina? What's up? How you doing? Camel woman, I know. So good. It's a family affair. Pretty cool. She used to run a lathe back in the day, work in the office, ship parts. We built the company together. And now she's over here helping me film. So good. Here we enter the assembly area again. For more than 45 years, we have our very special design. We call it dual block design. We have a machine bed and the base independent. And the machine bed is very compact. It's made of steel here, a weldment. So we get twice the strength as compared to cast iron. Once this is finished, we put it again on the machine base and then we continue the assembly. Why we achieve such a good thermal stability is here. Once you start the machine in the morning, you cut chips. You reach a very high temperature when you cut steel. And so this temperature goes, uh, approximately 80% of it goes with chips and cooling into the cooling tank or a chip conveyor. The lower one can change temperature but it has no effect on the upper system where we have to reach tight tolerances on the work pieces. And this concept we have more than 40 years. That's really unique on the market. Now that is the Emco Duo Block style where they take the bed and the base, they separate them. The bed is made out of steel plates welded and then the base comes on, it's a cast iron casting that basically sits on three points. This style right here is the best when it comes to thermal stability and when it comes to thermal displacement during the warm up. When you look at most machines, it's all cast iron. But guess what? 
This base is actually twice as strong as the cast iron and it is perfect. And it allows this machine to hit tolerances of three microns. That's absolutely insane. And that's why when you see somebody out there that has an Emco machine, they're gonna have nothing but good things to say about it. These machines are brick houses. They run decade in and decade out and they're amazing. And you know what else is amazing? Titans of CNC is a national distributor of Emco here in the United States. Boom, that means that all the education that we've ever done, we're gonna take it all to a higher level because we're going to be selling Emco machines along with Sile, along with some other ones, and we're gonna use that money to fund free education and to lift up our trade, boom. Now in this video, we're concentrating on the Hyperturn 65, such an incredible machine, and this is the exact machine that's coming back to Texas to my facility, which we're gonna be teaching and actually selling. And after this video, if you want more information, go into the description, you hit the link, boom, and all the information will be right there. Boom, let's go back to the video. And then we got the high precision version over here. They're all incredibly precise, but this one right here is just on another level. We're hitting tolerances of three microns on this machine. But one thing that I love right here is check it out. On the outside of the machine, that's not even looking at the controls over there, but on the outside of the machine right here, you actually have full simulation going on. So my virtual machine by Siemens is actually going on right here on the outside. One of the other cool uh, features is like, when you actually look at the chips coming out, you can have your chip come there on this side, or you can change it and it can come out on this side. And another cool thing is, check this out. You can actually come in here and just, Literally, as you stand right here, you can actually front load your tools right here. It's super clean. Like the design is incredible. And as a machinist, you come up to the machine, look at the work area, how, how big it is right there. And then even this glass right here, this protective glass, it's like a special glass that is uh, safety, but you still, it's just so big. You can just see everything as it's actually working right there. Very, very clean. Nice, nice controls right there. But just absolute beautiful machine. Oh man, I got Andre and Dominic over here. So where, where are you guys from? We're from Slovenia. 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 I, I was just walking past you and you were saying that you watch the videos, huh? Yeah. And it's like you can be anywhere in the world and yet it's a common language, CNC machining and G-code. And like I'm looking at the controls right here. This is exactly what I'll see in Texas or Slovenia, <laughs> right? And you guys have Amco machines. You guys just purchased or? Yes, we do. We have the Umil 630 and uh, Maxon 65 with two spindles. Awesome. What kind of parts do you guys make? Uh, we make plastic parts. Okay. Precision plastic parts. For like for the complex. medical or what kind of parts? Yeah, food, pharma, medical and also general industry. But awesome. technology evolving is amazing. Yeah. Is your family in manufacturing? Is that how you came into manufacturing? Or? Actually, it was by accident, to be honest. Okay. But it was a nice accident, so let's keep it going. Yeah? <laughs> awesome, man. Nice to meet you, brother. Nice to meet you, too. Awesome. Nice to meet you. Awesome. I was just talking to Simon, and you've been watching the videos ever since you started apprenticeship, huh? Yeah, of course. So after my second year of apprenticeship, I started watching his videos, and also this old Tony, he very... He, yeah, oh, I like him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your entire career, you did apprenticeship here at yeah. Emco. Six months ago, I completed my apprenticeship, nice. and now I'm studying engineering and trying to make a living, yeah. Oh. Trying to build a family. That's awesome, man. Yeah. CNC machining, no matter where you are in the world, it is... Uh, Basically, it's, it's the same everywhere. language. Yeah. Same language, man. It's same language, good. same problem, same people. Put metal in there, attack it, make money for your family. Yeah. Also, so I'm, I'm, I'm doing the same job as my dad 20 okay. years ago. So right. I'm second generation in the same company. So good. Boom. Boom. Yay. Yeah. One of the cool things that a lot of people don't know about Amco, especially in the US, is they're huge in education. One of the world's leaders. That's our smallest uh, machine for production, the E25, the, the version of machine we built since many, many years. We're well known in this field of application. One inch bar capacity, one spindle, tailstock, and a turret. And the same machine we can offer for education. Then we have the very unique control on a PC and we have uh, emulation running on the PC and you can train Siemens Fanuc 
Heidenhain and Fadwell control on one and the same machine. So here we are in the area where we assemble the small educational machines. This is the so-called concept turn 60. That's a slant bed machine for education. Here we have the smallest mill. And those machines are mainly used for CNC training. So young kids are educated in CNC programming. And so you can teach everything on one machine. 100% education machines. They've been doing it for a long time. It's so good, I love it. Let's make sure these kids know how to actually program CNC machines. And, and that's, that's one of the cool things about our academy, Titans of CNC Academy, is like it's free for everyone worldwide. So over here in Europe, they take apprenticeship programs very serious. So for in the US, we need to learn from Europe. We need to teach our kids about machining at an early age. We need to bring people in to the workforce and train them on CNC's. And now anybody in the US, anyone in the entire world can actually start an apprenticeship program basically for free because our curriculum at titansofcnc.com, just go up to the academies, all of it is free for everyone out there. Boom. Emco has uh, apprentices that start at like 15 years old, uh, give or take, and they actually learn how to run the machines, they learn how to assemble the machines, they learn how to work in the shop, and then uh, they secure themselves a lifelong uh, career right here in CNC machining, so super good. And of course, hey, we have to bring some Titans of CNC shirts from Texas, so man making the guys look amazing and stuff. I hope my English is not too rusty. <laughs> we built this size of educational machine since 1978. Mainly he does not block a production machine and he has enough time to get his experience on small machines to be later on fit for the big machines. We can cover the whole scope of machines starting from conventional machines so they should learn how to make a chip. Yeah. They should learn and they should feel is this tool sharp. They should see it, they, should, they shall hear it, they shall yeah. smell it to give the student the direct experience of hands-on working. I have to ask for a selfie. Look at that. Boom. Boom. Hey. <laughs> it's all man. What's up, Chris? How are you? I'm good, and you? You good? Yeah, yeah. Awesome, man. How's that shirt? Fits so good, right? It's space. It's like, oh, looking yeah, yoke yeah. over here. So, how, how old are you? I'm 17. 17? Yeah. And you're an apprentice here at Emco? Yes, for three years now. Three years now? Three years, yeah. Oh, and you're setting up the CNC machines? Yes. Awesome. My favorite machine in there. Your favorite? Yeah. Oh, what made you want to actually be an apprentice here at Emco? Because I love to work with CNC machines yeah. and to manufacturing and constructing prototypes and programming a lot. That's nice. I don't think a lot of people, this camera that I'm holding in my hand, that camera, your phone, the cars outside, yeah. this building, none of it exists yeah. without CNC machines. I love it. Yeah. I love it to work with metal. Yeah. So, so your dad watch, watches the Instagram yeah, yeah. and YouTube? Yeah, I follow you. Crazy. Follow you. Shout out to my dad. Joseph Shout out. Oh, so yeah. good. Your son is awesome over there. But the future is right here, right here at Emco. Boom. That's what it's about right there, teaching the younger generation that manufacturing is king. If you look at AI, if you look at automation, if you look at aerospace and, and all the products that are being made, they're all being CNC machined. Without CNC machining, like you would have nothing. And yet, a lot of people don't understand that fact that manufacturing is king. So we gotta teach them when they're young, teach them how to manufacture, how to create components, how to do it efficiently so they can make money for their families, they can secure crazy jobs in the workforce, and uh, just make it happen. Emco, you guys are doing it big. Super good. They just machined me this crazy glove right here, boom, on the U-Mill 630. We're here in Austria. By the way, thank you to the team, thank you to Emco. The hospitality has been absolutely amazing. Thank you, Peter. Man, you're super solid, thanks for setting it all up. And uh, boom, love it. Now guess what? That U-Mill is in Italy. It actually gets manufactured in Italy at an Emco plant. So we're jumping on a plane, my wife and I, we're gonna shoot over to Italy tomorrow, and we're gonna do another video showing how the U-Mill gets manufactured in Italy at the Emco plant. 
boom, crazy. So stay tuned and remember, Titans of CNC is the national distributor for Emco in the US. And if you want more information, go into the description, hit the link and everything that you need will be right there. Boom, we're out.